Me llamo Leslie Joana Tevillo Grajales, estudio gerencia en construcción y tú también puedes. From elementary up until middle school, I thought I wanted to become an architect. After talking with like advisors and people from the, the college, um, I realized that I love to be interacting with people. I also love helping out in my community and also like motivating people to push themselves into becoming like their greater self. I was like, yeah, that's construction management for me. It's very much of like project-based classwork and homework as well. So it does get into like that people side. We get to work with like all of our classmates and as well we get to talk to our professors in a very like friend way. But some of the coursework that we do is like scheduling, estimating materials and methods. My favorite part about CM is how everybody is inclusive and everybody is always very welcoming and I think that's that's my favorite part about this and as well as how industry members are always willing to welcome you as well and like extend a help if you ever need it. It says a lot about our industry. Just because it's male dominated doesn't mean that you don't belong here and that's why I feel like Every time I see another female, like I always want to like, like yeah, like push her, you know, like um, and make her feel inclusive as well. Like if she's like sitting apart from everybody else, I want to like bring her into our group. And it's just about about that, like hold each other up and push each other up, and not just because it's a male-dominated industry and major. Um, it doesn't mean that like you're not welcome. Some of the resources that are available here in uh, the CM department, a lot of clubs, a lot of competition teams, and as well as like networking with the industry. Out of the clubs in CM that I joined were uh, Women in Construction, AGC, and then Empower. And then a new one that just came up was the First Generation Multiculture. These clubs do bring a lot of like networking in. I'm currently the president of Women Construction. It's amazing to see how like industries are always like reaching out and like they want to like be part of it. But we do do like coffee talks, panels, tours, uh, job stop tours. Some of the people that are shaping my experience today here in CSU is some faculty, teachers, professors. It's a big community that's pushing me to become greater. Some of the misconceptions that go around in CM in the industry is you're going to get down and dirty every time that like you're out in the field. It just depends on like what you go for. Some of the careers that you can go into um, after you graduate from here, going into scheduling and becoming an estimator, becoming a superintendent and becoming a project manager as well as uh, BDC, so like BIM coordinating and as well as like working the drones, um, but that, there's a lot. I am bilingual and it just makes it easier for me to interact with the trade people and I think the trade people are great people. I am able to bond with them and I am also able to advocate for them because I'm able to speak their language, their first language as well, uh, which was my first language. I see my degree taking me um, in becoming a superintendent, so I do want to go into the path of becoming a superintendent one day and then slowly going into the office afterwards after I know how the field works.